How's it going, Tank? It's me, and welcome back to some World of Tanks console. When these ginormous Japanese things have appeared in the uh, tech tree, and this is the OI Experimental Tier 5 Japanese Heavy, which is bigger than pretty much most of the other tanks in the game, including most of the Tier 10s. Yeah, and look how fast it moves. It's just like a goes like a medium tank, and it's completely screwed up. I think Experimental in the name. OI experimental means the Japanese tank designers were experimenting with drugs whilst they designed this tank. Yeah, it's completely screwed up. And um, just like the mid tier matchmaking is screwed up. Whoever's team has the worst OI drivers is going to lose. And I've got three other OIs on my team. And well, yeah, just watch what happens. Anyway, team destruction. So uh, it's all going to go one way or the other. There we go, we lost the tank already. Heavy tank, looks like. And um, yeah, it's just going to be one of those games. But I wanted to show you some footage. So here's my best attempt out of seven games. Every single one was a defeat. This is my most recent purchase. And the purchase before, which you're going to see soon, I scraped up some silver and treated myself to... Oh, look, there's lots of red names appearing. And it's all happening. Yeah. Right, quick note then. Um, don't have six cents. Start a new crew. So I don't think I'm going to be pulling out anything too impressive out of these tanks until I get a um, decent crew in it. It's going to be a while. So what was I was saying, yeah. Played seven games in this tank. Lost every single one. Scraped up the silver to buy the T110E4. One of the um, American tank destroyers. And um, I've won every single game. <laughs> yeah, so I don't. I, I can't be too harsh on myself. I don't think it's uh, it's my fault. I was on an epic losing streak. Mm, could be side scraping here though. Might have saved myself a little bit of health. I am poking out one of the weakest points of the tank. Never mind. Right, so this T1 heavy. I should have loaded a high explosive round a little sooner. Gonna finish them off a bit quicker. There you go, bounce to the premium AP. Why am I using premium AP? Well, look at the team list and look at what tanks we've lost already. And, like I said, I had already lost, I think this was probably the sixth game, so I'd already lost five games in a row. And my patience was starting to be tested ever so slightly. Especially when there's a one shot. Tier 5 Heavy sat in front of some of my teammates and they can't kill it. And I end up having to do it all. Yeah. Just first world problems, eh? Right, so you can see whose team had the worst OIs now. My team. So I've lost already. Just need to try and get out of this game what I can. Thinking about this tank, it's so big. But the armor's not actually that good. There's loads of weak spots and the turret is a weak spot. It can be penned by, hmm, well not everything you can meet, oh there we go, look, it's down to four tanks now. And we're three and a half minutes through the game. And that's what mid-tier matchmaking is like at the minute. Alright, so we've banged Churchill. Time to turn around and try and deal with what's coming. So I'm looking at the tanks that are left on the way over. Trying to see what we've got left. Time to dig in for one last ditch attempt to get a decent game out of this tank and try and speed up my grind for it as quickly as possible. Don't think I'll be keeping this one. It's a good tank. I expect in a few months time when there's less of them floating around it'll be a tank to come back to but at the minute when it's four or five per team absolutely yeah uh, yeah just Bad. Well, so set up now for a size great. Start actually thinking about what I'm doing. Here they come. Right, so I've got high explosive loaded. Finish off the T34. Here comes a Panzer 1C. He thinks he can penetrate me. And he didn't quite realise how manoeuvrable the OI was. And he's dead. Now oh, look, here comes some uh, OIs with lots of health. Got the wrong round loaded. I track him. And he repairs it. 
Anyway, he ram kills one of our dudes. Never mind. Right, so we aim up some weak spots. Kill one of our experimental. But there's still a couple on the enemy scene there. Right, who's next? Right, you want some, do you? There's another experimental. But oh, look, here comes another full health experimental. And I'm dead. Yeah. I think I did quite well there to last as long as I did and pick up seven kills. But, um, yeah. I need help. If there was one or two of OIs per team, I probably could have maybe pulled that off. But with five on the enemy team and some of them turning up on full health, absolutely no chance. Well, the results then. Decent amount of XP. Hardly any credits because I fired premium AP, but I really don't care because I want to get through this tank as quickly as possible and get rid of it. So there we go. Just over 1800 damage and you can see why I lost now. Like I said, whoever's got the best OIs or just the OIs that know how to not die in the first three minutes of the game. Um, yeah, that's what it's all about, isn't it? Teamwork at the end of the day. Right, that's it for today, fellas. Give it a like if you did, and I'll catch you on the next one. See you later.